Texas Chainsaw Massacre the game has been out for a little while now, and I haven't really seen anyone make videos on killer ideas. So today that's exactly what we're doing. I'm going to be making up my own killers that I think would be cool in the game, and putting some in here from the movies. So let's get right into it. My first one being Chop Top. As of this moment, Chop Top has not been added, but he is easily the most highly requested family member to be added. Why? Because he's so charismatic and he's so funny. My brain is burning! Non-flashback! Non-flashback! Oh. The interesting thing about Chop Top is he's a Vietnam veteran and his head was cut into by a machete and that's why he has a steel plate on his head. So I think his weapon could be a coat hanger. Of course he would be a faster, more agile character, very similar to the Hitchhiker. I think he would move quite similarly. And his abilities could potentially link to Vietnam. So either he creates explosives, right? So he attaches them to certain objects like the battery or whatever. So if a victim uses it, it explodes in their face, alerting the other family members, stunning them for a couple seconds, and then they get back up and they took some damage, you know? That'd be really cool. My next one is Tinker or just a mechanic killer in general. If we're going with Tinker from Texas Chainsaw 3, then his weapon would be a hook hand. Either way, I think they should do a killer with a hook hand. If Tinker's not the killer, they should just do it anyway, because that'd just be cool. But if it's not Tinker, I would do a mechanic with a power drill. Either way, their ability could be like Connie for the family. Instead of lockpicking things super quickly, they can turn on escape exits if they've already been disabled. So it's like an instant turn back. So they can turn it back on instantly or they can turn it off instantly. So for example, if they exit through the battery or they turn off the battery, he'll be able to repair the battery in like two seconds. So they can turn it back on again. On to Sheriff Hoyt. Now I think his main weapon of choice would be a shotgun without any ammunition in it at first. So he just gun bashes you with it. So think of the brutal kills you could have with that. Someone just bashing your head in with the end of a gun, right? Perfect. And then his ability could be that he gathers ammo and it's a single shot shotgun and he can shoot it in close range. It does a ton of damage. So the victims would have plenty of places to take cover and stuff like that. And I wouldn't oversaturate the map with ammo. But it would be cool. Maybe if there's multiple victims nearby, it can spread to them as well. So I think Sheriff Hoy would be a great addition to this game. Next would be Matthew McConaughey's character, Vilmer Slaughter. Come on, man. Tell me this guy would not be amazing. I feel like if there's anyone you gotta get in this game, it's him and Chop Top. You gotta get these two in the game. He could also use the shotgun as a weapon. Like, you could make his ability be Sheriff Hoyts because he does do that in the movie. But since he's a tow truck driver and I want to make him different, I would just give him a tire iron here. That's a pretty unique weapon. You could have some cool kills with that. And his ability could be he can jump out of windows and recover almost instantly. That would just be a fun little callback to his movie because that's what he does. Me and maybe he can hold victims down with his mechanical leg for a little while waiting for the family. But the downside could be if you escape, his leg is jammed so he can't move for a little while. So it kind of works out. This next killer, they definitely will not do, but it would be super badass if they did something similar. And that is remake Jason, but don't call him that because of copyright. You could go with like the sackhead version. I think that would fit a lot more with Texas Chainsaw, or you could give him any mask. It doesn't matter. You could give him like an animal head, but make him a really slow, brutish character with max savagery. Make it so he literally cannot get stunned. It's like Jason with rage and make it so he has his own wells right so similar to alien from dead by daylight where alien can travel under the map and you control it 
do the same thing, but make it realistic and say, oh, he has his own wells on the map that only he can access. And make him really slow so it's not cheese. I think that would be perfect. I want more brute characters in this game. This is another one of my killer ideas, and that is a hunter. His weapon could be a hatchet, and his ability could be he can equip a sort of ghillie suit in a way because the camo for the survivors works really well. Like, you can hide in bushes and stuff like that, and the, the, the killers won't even notice. You can hide in plain sight, and the killers won't even notice. Now, what if this hunter had the same sort of ability... And whenever you activated it, the detection radius for that killer is gone for a little while. So he has like a stalk mode and then he uses like a ghillie suit or something like it just automatically appears on him and he can like hide in the plants or whatever. And maybe you could even give him a bow and arrow. That would be wicked cool. This killer is similar to Sissy. So I kind of had trouble coming up with her ability. But I think this could be a cool idea. And that is a nurse character. Now, immediately you motherfuckers are going to go, Oh, Dead by Daylight! Nothing like Dead by Daylight, okay? A legit nurse who has a syringe as a weapon. So maybe her ability is when she pokes you with the syringe, she gathers an absurd amount of blood for Grandpa. I, I would have her poison you, but Sissy's ability is literally that, so it doesn't really work it would be just like a clone of sissy and that's not what you want of course if you guys have any idea of what a nurse character could do let me know below but i think that would just be a cool killer to do and she could you know have really cool lines of dialogue next is a slaughterhouse killer and he should have a meat hook for a weapon but the thing is the hook has a chain on it so he can throw the hook at you and pull you back that's his ability he can pull you toward him That'd be really cool if this character was like a brute character who is also a little bit slower, but because he has this ability where he can pull you towards him, it kind of balances out. I think that'd be a really cool idea. This one you're also going to compare to Dead by Daylight, but I think they should have a showman character. It could be a cowboy town celebrity type of character who throws throwing knives for a living. That's his whole thing. So you can just have a throwing knife character. Why not? It's cool. My final killer idea. Now, I know this will never happen, ever, but hear me out, okay? Pearl. Tell me she would not be perfect for this game. Hear me out, all right? Her ability could be just like Julie's, where she can run and she has a ton of stamina, but she like dances or skips as she's running towards you. Come on, it's meant to be. And her weapon could be an ax, she could have some awesome, brutal kills. Hear me out, all right? But that's my list of killers that I think should be in the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Let me know your killer ideas down below. Like the video if you enjoyed the video. If you didn't enjoy the video, don't be a pussy. Like the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.